What is going on everyone? Riddick here and welcome to Off the Shelf Air Guns. Today we have the Gamo Shadow Whisper out here and uh, we're going to be doing some accuracy with it. See what we can do at about 35 yards. Uh, just open sights like you know how I am and uh, we will be using the RWS R10 Match. It really likes these. And so yeah without further ado we're going to get right into it. I got a target out there at 35 yards. I'm not trying to hit no beetle sized little targets like I usually do. I got a 12 inch target out there, something we can really uh, get a hold of. And we're going to see what we can do with open sights. I do have it on the stand here. So it is a bit of a bench rest shooting, which, you know, I don't normally do. I'm an offhand shooter, but I do like to do the bench rest to really hone it in and see where we're at. And we'll worry about offhand shooting and stuff like that down the line. But uh, yeah, so here we go. See what we can do. All right. All righty then. See what we can do. I'm interested because so far, just in what I have done with it, it has been quite accurate. So let's see what we got here. Okay. All righty, all righty. We will do, uh, you know, I don't know, eight or so shots, maybe more, maybe less, I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. Huh. I feel like, I, did that go through the same one? <laughs> that would be crazy. And that's windy. All right. So, let's keep going. Oh. I was a little jumpy on that one. Don't know where it hit. It's, uh, even though I got it on that big target, it's still hard to see from here. Yes, I know, I need a spotter scope. Maybe one of these days. Yeah, I'm having a hard time seeing where it's hitting. I know it's hitting right above that red circle, and that's kind of where I'm putting it. But I know they're a couple, maybe one or two, have not uh, stayed within the group. They're kind of separated there. Got to keep them separated. That's okay, though. We're just going to keep going. It is open sights. And that's what I like the most. Of course, you know, down the line, we might put the scope on this and see what we can really do with it. We may move it out to 100 yards and see if we can do something with it out that far. Should you be worried about what it's doing out that far? Probably not. But I just like to push to the limit because I can. <laughs> oh, that sunlight's messing with me. And, uh, <laughs> that's, I think it's still right there, but that had a little bit of a glare on my sight there from the sunlight. No biggie. No biggie. Let's keep going here. I'm starting to see a little bit of a section there developing on there, which hmm, so far ain't too, too terrible considering what we're doing here. All right. I'm just going to keep going. Now that one uh, may have hit a slight bit higher. Maybe a bit, slight bit higher. But then again, I am a little bit weebly wobbly here, even though it's on the stand 
it's not dead still when you're holding it. You still, <laughs> still have a little bit of wiggly wobbly going on. I think for the most part we're doing pretty good though. Let's do like three more. Do three more. See where we're at at that point. But I mean it. it <laughs> Isn't looking too bad from here. I mean, could it be better? Oh yeah, it could be better, but we're talking open sights here. 35 yards. Okay. Two more. Two more. There goes that sunlight again, glaring on the end of my sight. All good. Make it work. All right, one more here. All right. I think that might look pretty good, actually. And uh, I said one more, but it wasn't the last one, as usual. We got to do one more. You know what we got to do. So it hasn't happened yet, and somebody's going to say something, probably nibs. So we got to make, we got to make sure he's happy. <laughs> Putting. There you go. <laughs> so there we go. Let me go. Let me. Uh, Get this thing out of the way. Let me go down there and get that, and then uh, we'll take a look at it up close because I'm curious to see it up close. All right. So it turns out it's actually better than I was anticipating. We've got uh, a pretty solid group right around here. You can see the target size fit based on my hand here. But we've got a pretty solid group right around here. And then of course these ones that kind of went all around the area here. I think maybe we did go through the same hole a couple times, which is pretty good, <laughs> pretty good. But uh, you know, aside from things moving around, we do have a pretty solid group right there. Of I think it was, I think it was five because I think it went through the same hole on one. But uh, yeah, there it is. So, hmm. open sight to 35 yards. I'm not going to complain about that because you can definitely continue to fine tune that in. We're already doing real good, you know, and this gun is barely even broke in. The more we break it in, the more we shoot it and everything else, it's just going to get better. Okay. So yeah, very, very, very cool. With that said, I will catch you all down the road.